In this tutorial, I will show you how to hide the default WordPress login page. Let's check the login page of this website. As you can see, we got redirected to the home page. The only way to log into this site is through a login page that we created ourselves. Let's enter an incorrect username in this form. As you can see, the form beautifully displays the login page messages. Now I will enter the correct username and password. You can see that we have been successfully redirected to the WordPress dashboard. To test the logout, I will log out from this dashboard. You can see that we have successfully logged out of the admin dashboard. Let's get started. Go to the link in the video description and copy the code for creating the login shortcode. To insert this code in WordPress, you can either copy it into the functions.php file of your child theme or like me use the code snippets plugin. This plugin is completely free and allows you to place PHP codes on your site. From the Snippets menu, select Add New. Paste the code here. Write a title for it. Now save and activate it. Let's create a new page as the login page. Add the login shortcode to this page. You can get the shortcode name from the code you copied in the previous step. Publish the page. I open this page with a different browser. Let's test it by entering an incorrect username. Now I enter the correct username and password. You can see that we have been successfully redirected to the WordPress dashboard. Alright, we've completed the first step. In the second step, we need to redirect the WordPress WP login page. To do this, I'll copy this code. I paste it here. I write a title for it. Let's save and activate it. Now let's check the admin page with a different browser. As you can see, we have been redirected to the home page, so the code worked successfully. If you want visitors to be redirected to a different page, write its URL here. I'll write the address of the 404 page here. Let's search for the word login. As you can see, it displays the newly created login page. In the next step, we hide this page from the search results.
To do this, copy this code. Paste the code here and write a title for it. Here, you should write the ID of the new login page. The ID of the page we created is 10. Save and activate the code. Now our login page won't be displayed in the site search results. Let's check our login page one more time. You should bookmark this address or remember it. Well, that's it. If this video was helpful to you, please like it and subscribe to the channel so that more people can watch it. Thank you for watching and have a great day.